It doesn't matter, but the stop is being used here, isn't it? It's used, being used in buy stop or sell stop, isn't it? I just want to know what does that stop mean. I think it's a, it's a it's placing an order, it's like a stop order, it's placing an order before that price was explaining. Yeah. It's placing an order before you reach the price, uh, when the price is still low. You are waiting for the price to keep in. You are no, buying. I was getting that, there's an exact definition. Okay. No, that's to do with stop order. Next entry, when you buy, uh, when you reach the target, you are in the trade. Mm -hmm. So basically, when you reach that price, you are in the trade. Mm -hmm. What you think you place an order when the price reaches that you want to buy? Exactly, yeah. So what, what does it mean? You see, there's a, there's a general generic definition for a stock, okay? Right? And based on what you want to do as an entry, then everything else then will become a stock loss or a target. But the stock definition never changes. <coughs> Let me explain. Once I explain, it will all start to make sense. Then we'll start seeing different, different ideas. But this one is important. Huh? So let's take a look at this definition. A stop order, when you place, when you place any trading order, is a stop, when you put a thing called a buy stop or a sell stop, the stop itself, what it means is that it's a worse price. Okay, come on. Worst price then? What? See, you can only say something is worse compared to something, right? Compared to what? To the, 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 the market price. Very good. The market price. Mm -hmm. Or common price, right? All right. This is the generic definition. This definition you must understand, huh? Because this one will never change. Then everything else I'm going to explain is going to refer back to this. You must get this right, okay? Limit. Is going to be the opposite of that. What does that mean? Yeah, yeah what is it? So stop is worse price than good price. Yeah, or better price. Yeah, better price than the market or current price. Okay. Okay. Good. Huh? Right, so let's take a look. Cheaper, right? Yeah. You want to buy this often on the cheap, no? So it's a better price. 
Now, once is better, is it going to be a stop or a limit according to the definition? Limit. Yeah, got it? Yeah. So, if I were to put that in terms of trading terminology, I am buying or selling them? Buying. Buying. Right. So, buying. And am I buying it at a better price or a worse price compared to this? So, therefore, is it going to be a buy stop or a buy limit? Buy limit. Now, and that would be my entry into the market. So that's my entry of the market. Okay. So got here. Okay. So that's how we define that dollars. Now, let's say, for some reason or another, you tell the car dealer, um, you, are, you are in a mindset of you know, buying and selling it quick. Okay? And you think, for the last 10 years, it's always remained at 500,000 pounds. Okay? It's been stacked. You want a bit of momentum to come into the market. So you tell him, listen, I know this sounds odd, but if the Ferrari comes up to 520,000, then I'm going to give me a call and I want to buy it. Now, most of us will be thinking this guy's an idiot. Why does he want to buy it? More expensive. Because you want to buy so you can sell it five weeks later. Because you, in your research, you have found out whatever research you've done or whatever guys you've talked to, you found out that if it increases by 20,000, then there's a good amount of um, spec, um, there's a good amount of interest in the crowd in the market on Ferraris that they will tend to buy more, and for 520,000, it can increase to 500,000. That doesn't make sense for the life example. It doesn't make sense because you would never buy, you would never ask for more expense. Exactly, you, you never would. But then, funny enough, but in the market, we keep on doing it. Um, the only reason you would ever do that. If you're a trader and if you're looking for some kind of momentum to come into the market, oh, yeah. and you don't want to enter a stagnant market which always lies in my Okay, that right. makes sense for trading. Like, yeah. doesn't make sense. But this is why I told you you're buying a car just to trade only in about yeah. three, four weeks' time. Okay. The way you are explaining it, maybe I would say each time I go there, the guarantee are gone. Yeah. And they, 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 they beat and then they. they and then I don't find him. Then I then I come for, then I went there and then I say to to to, to him, okay, if you get out now, which is this price? Yeah. Okay, I'll take it for myself. Yeah. Just, you know, so yeah, you can do whatever it is. My my point here is that he bought it at five twenty. Is that a worse price than that? It's a worse. Yeah. It's a worse price, right? So therefore, what am I doing here? Am I buying or selling here? Buy, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. But. Then the second word is it a stop or a limit? Is it a worse price than buying or a better price? Stop. The stop, right? That's it. So that's what stop and limit means. Okay. Okay. Better price or worse mm -hmm. price. Mm -hmm. Now let's go through a few more examples. Now let's imagine you are the dealer right now. Mm -hmm. Let's say you are the dealer right now. So therefore you are a seller or you're a buyer. I was a buyer before. No, but now you're the dealer. Let's say. Yes. You're all dealers, right? Yes. Yeah, car dealers, yeah? Right. So are you a seller or a buyer right now? I'm a seller. Seller, that's right, yeah. So, let's change. Now, you decide the current market price is 500,000 pounds. Okay? You decide to sell it at a lower price just because you want people to come in. You want to create a bit of hype. You want to get your name out and then you want to increase it and so on, right? So, this is the opening price. You just open your new company. Area, you just want to attract a few people into the, to the car dealership. So, what are you doing right now? Are you selling or are you buying? I'm selling. selling. Now, sell, but are you selling at a worse price than a current market price or a better price? I'm selling at a worse price. Therefore, is it a stop or is it a limit? It's stop. 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 Let's try it. Very good. And that is also an entry order because that's how we're entering into the market. Mm -hmm. Right? Right, now next, if you were to sell it at 520, okay, what is that? What are you doing here? Selling or buying? Sell. Sell, and what is it? Is it stop or a limit? Is it better price than market or worse price than market? It's a limit. It's a limit, that's right. So we want that. You see, the point here is that the definition of the stop and the limit, does it change or does it not change? It doesn't change. It's always stop is a worse price. Maybe it's always a better price. But it becomes subjective to whether you're a buyer or you're a seller. 
Okay? Let's say you must keep continuously thinking about it. Now, we will go into some market examples. So what then? Now, if you all are clear, that means I can ask questions in one connection. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's good. Okay, let's see. Now. So, so we got right over here. Let's say that in currency or like not in GPS, it's not making you any money. Why would you like that? Okay, okay. <laughs> okay. It doesn't matter. Alright, so GP, USD, okay, what trend is it? What trend? Okay, right, now, so let's say current, what's the current price right now? Give me the 1.7 something. Okay, let's see. 1.7? 1.7? So this is your current price or your market. Now, let's say on um, a dynamic breakup trade, you want to enter along here. So let's say that's for 1.7. Right? So you want to enter what? You want to enter, you want to buy or you want to sell? In the uptrend. Five. Five, five, right? You want to go the wrong uh, direction of the trend. So we want to buy, okay? So your entry order is going to be a what order? Buy or sell? Buy. Buy, right? Now, if the current market price is 1.7129, and if I want to tell the broker that I want to buy at 1.7500, then is that a stop or a limit order? Stop. Stop. Okay, so it's a stop. Yeah? You want to stop that? Yes. Yeah, worst price, isn't it? Yes. Yeah? Good. Now, my sell stop, let's say I want to keep it around here, okay? Let's say 1.7. So, that's my stop loss. And my stop loss, therefore, would be what am I doing at my stop loss? Am I buying or selling? Selling, right? Yeah? You keep going along. Exactly, that's right, yeah. But that's the only way to exit. No? Once you bought something, the only way to get out of it, either a profit or a boss, is to sell. Sell, right? That's how you do it in the real world as well, no? So sell. But now, the stop loss, is it going to be a stop or a limit? It's not limit. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Think about it, the definitions. It's sell limit. To sell limit. Um, sell limit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, because, yeah. Okay, now let's think about this, huh? So you bought, you want to buy at this price, right? Yes. 7500 yeah. yeah? Now, you want to sell, which is better for you? If you sold cheaper than that or higher than that? If you sold higher than that, is it a better price or a worse price? If I sell at 1.70? Yeah, if you, okay, let's, let's, let's the worst time. No, yeah, exactly. If you bought at 175 and you sold at 170, or even if you bought at current price, 171, two, yeah. and you sold yeah. it at 170, is that a worse or is that better? It's worse. It's worse. worse. So yeah. therefore, it is a stock for a limit. Okay, it's good. So you need The worst time is a limit. It's a, it's a stock, I'm sorry, it's a stock. Because it's the worst price. So everyone agrees it's a yes, stop? Yes. Yeah. It's a stop. Because you're making a loss, right? Yeah. What's the worst, worst price for you, no? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. See, the golden rule is what? You always want to buy cheap, you want to sell? Buy cheap. You want to buy cheap and you want to sell? Buy and that's it, right? So anything selling lower than market price is the worst price. Anything buying cheaper than market price is a? It's a good price, it's a limit, that's right. What is the target you can live? Exactly, it's spot on, yeah. See, but think, but think about it. You're doing nothing different than what you do in your everyday life, doesn't it? Every time you want to buy something, you like to buy it cheap, cheap or you want to buy it expensive? I want to buy it. What is it? You don't smile to the shopkeeper. What do you want? Yeah, which is... Exactly, which is usually a bargain, which is actually... 
and you would like to get in the bargain, and which would be cheaper than the price you're quoting or more expensive? Yeah, cheaper, right? Yeah. Okay, so that would definitely be a better product, that would be a dream price for a buyer, isn't it? That's what you always want. Now, the worst price, of course, is buying it more expensive. So over here, we are doing that, so it's called buying small. In terms of a seller perspective, you always want to sell high. If you're not selling high, and if you're selling lower than the current market, then it is it's the worst price, the market price is sell small. Okay, got it? If we uh, enter in the market line, So that's what we will shock a little. 
I feel short, yeah, it comes in the end. So, right, so now let's think about it. So now, let's say current price is around here. The so current price is, what's the current price right now? Is it, is it 1.101? Oh, let me see. It's 1.3 one, 468. One 4, 0, 6, is it? 6, 8. The last digit doesn't matter. 1, 3, 4, 0, 6, huh? 6, 6, 7. 4, 6, 7. Alright. 1, 3, 4, 6, 7. Okay, good. So the current price right now is one three four six seven. Huh? Mm -hmm. Now, let's say I want to put a sell order. Let's say for the low of this thing. Yeah, this is what you know, that I break up. You know? So you guys tell me, and then my stop loss, I'm gonna put it around here. So this level here is three four. I'm gonna put it. It's three five. And then. My target is going to be at 1.3. So you guys jot down what each one of these orders should be. So let's draw it down in the book and then um, mm -hmm. do it easily. Mm -hmm. so, that's the last thing. Tell me what this one is. Can you jot it down? I have a version of the website because I always have an option. Oh, is it? But do you at least understand this? Yes. I think that's the most important. Well, they told you what they're going to do now. And you keep on thinking. Okay, sorry. Okay, very good. Yeah. That would be a buy stop. 
Why is it a small? It's a big This is uh, the worst price that we need to lose money. What do you mean, lose money? Uh, because it's the worst price. What's the point? From, from, from our country price. From what? So what is the worst price? Why? From the entry, from the price we entered, is the worst price. The lowest and nothing to do. See, look at the definition. So, but where does it ever say anything to do with entry price? Always comparing the market price. Um, Current price. So it's the, it's the worst price. Then. People are selling. It's nothing to do with the price we set. Oh. So, what does it do with the price? Okay, take two minutes out, go through all these definitions, and understand why are we calling it what we are calling it, and then I'm just not. Think in your head. Remember, the, the, sport, uh, the sport definition doesn't change, but whether a price is higher or lower, whether it's stock or not, depends and changes depending on the subject of whether you're a buyer or seller. Have all the questions in your head first and then ask me this one. Not at all for the next two, three minutes. Please, then, the next one. You see, you know, you know the one thing that always helps you much more faster and makes you understand it? If you look at this and you find they are confused for about two, three minutes and five minutes and you and then block somewhere, you just put your mind on the train. Just yeah. think of a life example outside. That's the best way. Please, um, that. Please, I have bought this thing at 1.35. Now, I'm just speaking your head first, and then we will um, resume about 15 minutes. Um, just speak it loud in your head, and go through everything that I've said so far. Um, It's something that is confusing me to me here because I know that when 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 buy I'm if I'm buying when then the trade goes up. So why is it down because I'm selling now? If it goes up, why is it say buy from the thing to sell? It's not very good because I'm not saying I'm not buying, I'm selling. I'm saying, why is the price stop? I know that the price stop is the worst price in the market. And then now, if now I'm, I'm selling, why should I sell at the price stop? Oh, okay, okay. So, uh, if it's, uh, when we want to sell, we want to sell at a high price. The price is high, but then it's low. That's why we call that. So, okay. so if we want to sell, 
the annual budget. Now the price, the current price is this one in the market. Yeah. So it means that if this one for the is the current price, after you bought it, then they got it on selling that price. So please uh like using it on selling. No, you you be you be selling it uh one one point three four hundred. So we sell stocks there. Oh. We sell stocks. That's been it's the worst price. Okay. So we will we always want to sell high. Okay. Is that what she's asking about the car and why is the buy stuff? Is that what you asking? Yeah. Why is the buy stuff? Yeah, why is she asking why is the buy stuff? Oh, because um, we, for instance, uh, we have this Ferrari car, uh, 400. Yeah. And we, we sold it there. And the, well, the question is, is it down the time? Why are you having a buy stuff, right? Because we, we make the lose money there. So that's the buy stock is the worst. Yeah, so the buy stock is actually the worst. The worst price. And the third part, the worst price. No, no, she only has the entry for three. Three orders here, right? What are they? Okay. Entry, stock, stock. And then the tokens. That's right. So this buy stock is your? Only when you're selling, it's still giving you a buy stock. You can sell it. Yeah, think of what it why though. There's a good question, why? Why is it going to be selling when you can have like a buy order that buy? That's good. I mean, how I'm saying it, it's you as a buyer. Okay, if it's, if it's yeah, yeah. As a seller. If it's hard to maybe uh, explain what you're selling, think in terms of a buying is if you went to a shop, right? You all went to a shop, you all bought let's say a watch for hundred pounds. Once you bought already, to make a profit or what how much you do? Once you have bought something, to make a profit or a loss, you must sell it. Am I right to say that? Am I not right? You are right. Yeah, yeah. It's, not, it's not anything complex, right? It's what you, you all do, you know? eBay is the same thing, right? Yes. People buy, they don't sell, right? Okay. But of course, the thing which is complicated here is that how can, how can I sell first? But Forget about that, just assume that we can do it. But if I'm buying first, that's the usual scenario, isn't it? If I'm buying first, make a profit or loss, then I must sell. I don't agree, man. That's basically yeah, okay. The opposite is true. If I sold first, make a profit or loss, I must buy. Buy back, you still don't get it. Yeah, I need to, I need to think. Why not? It's just the opposite. Right? Mm -hmm. if, but you get the first example. You you understand the first example? Yes, I understand. You buy you once you buy something, immediately you become a seller to make a profit or a loss. Yes. So the opposite for selling. Once you've sold something, immediately you become a buyer. Or a profit or a loss. Yes. So that's uh, the reason to explain why is it up by stock because you've sold already. You put a penny in order to sell. Once you enter into the market to protect yourself against loss, just like what somebody was saying, you got to buy it back. And then to get a profit, you also have to enter as a seller. So that more you have to. You entered as a seller already. Yes. So to get a profit, you must be a. Buyer. Buyer. Always the opposite. Okay. To get a loss, you must be a. a, a seller. A Once you enter as a seller, okay. you must. Enter a buyer. You're a buyer. Either you are getting out a profit or a loss. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's more simpler. You see, if you get confused, you always think about the buying side. Because the buying is also simple for you, no? Once you buy something, you have to sell for a profit or a loss. Does that make sense? Then for a stock post would be a seller, then target would be a seller. So the sell is just opposite. Okay. Yeah? Because you always go from this reference point, which you're clear with. Once you buy something as an entry, the only way to exit. The only way to exit is either for a loss or either for a profit. And the only way to do that is only to sell. 
The loss is what we call as a stock loss, so it's a limited loss. The profit is what we call as a net, which is a target. That's all. So the opposite again for for sell or the short order. If I enter as a sell, as a short, then I can either buy for a loss or I can buy for a profit. And the loss is the stock loss. The profit is the target loss. Yeah. 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 Yeah
Why is it sell price from our perspective? It's just like when you go here. Um, it would be a sell price from the from, from the houses. No. Um, the best way to explain this is because we are the buyer. Okay, let's 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 go from this perspective. You go to Hermes, yeah. Right. So let's say there's this laptop there. Let's say Samsung laptop. We see, okay. And next to the Samsung laptop, there's this price tag over there, which is called 2,700 pounds. Huh? Yes. Now, is, is that, in terms of your perspective, is that to buy or is that to sell? It's selling. No, from your perspective. Oh, buy, oh, buy. Yes. Yes. You can't sell them, but you've got to buy it. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So you have to buy. So, in terms of your perspective, it's a buying price, no? Yeah. So you can buy off it for two thousand seven hundred pounds. Is he making a profit on that or not? Yes. 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 Ethically issue. Yes. Yeah. Ethically issue. Now, therefore, am I right to say the cost price of this Samsung this car is, is lower than two thousand seven hundred pounds? Yeah. Yes. He would have bought it from someone else for a lower price. Yes. Let's say it's two thousand five hundred. Yeah. The key bought from yeah yes. someone. Then he's selling it at. Okay. But from your perspective, it's still fine. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, this one is known as the false price, right? For curries, yeah. Mm -hmm. But in terms of the market, this is known as a sell price. Mm -hmm. Yes, but it's not from. It's the, it's the no, it's from your perspective. Sell back to you. All I'm saying is, you can buy the Samsung laptop from him. At 2,700 pounds right now, because that's the shelf price, right? Once you enter the shop, that's where you see 2,700. But for some reason or other, tomorrow, or well, let's just say five minutes, we walk out of the store, yeah? And you are like, you know what? I don't like this laptop, I want another one. So basically, wait, I must need to complete this before you um, get because all you can get. <laughs> Once you walk out of the shop, you already get 2,700 pounds, right? Once you walk out of the shop, then you think, you know what? I think I don't want this laptop, I want to go change it for another one, right? Then you go back and you say, you know what, I want to sell this back to you. That very minute, the very even was five minutes only, he will only buy it back from you. Not at this price, you only buy it back from you at 2000 I see. So this is your sell price, mm -hmm. in terms of your perspective. Okay. Okay? <laughs> okay. So you already lost immediately 200 pounds, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Now that 200 pounds, in terms of the real world, you can call it maybe a margin or whatever, they get marked up. Or in terms of trading, what is known as a spread. So basically, right now, finish my Yeah. All the prices on the chart are cost prices. Uh, yeah, that's where you no. All the um, yes, so exactly right. Yes, cost prices. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. But this is cost price in terms of the dealers. Yeah, but. Ask this way. For me, as a customer, I won't know their price. Did I get? I will not know their price. You only say things. Well, yes, in the real world, you won't know. In, in my real time, we don't say, oh. It's spot on. You see the cars, right? Cars are the yeah. same thing, no? Depreciation immediately, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's all it is. So the ones you're seeing on the chart is not cost price. Yeah. Okay, so therefore it makes sense that whenever you want to buy it, the spread is added on to that. That's all. Okay. And is this situation where it's not added? It always has to be added, though, no matter what you do, no? Even if you enter as a seller, as a shop first, it's not added then, but it will be added when you want to exit, right? Yes. Okay. I know, I like the same thing. So, to me, it's not a few times when I give the place a trade earlier, and then I come home, wait, and I want to wait. And already, I think maybe they will cheap it. So I can't buy at the prices I see now. So I have to add some 125 piece. Is that 
Oh, you don't need to add one. Yes, they will tell you that uh, your your pending order got to be a few pips away. Yeah, sometimes you can't enter the price, but the price was more if we try to enter a few hours later. And if there's a rapid movement, then sometimes you can't enter after the book in the journal prices. And then you, your uh, pending order is rejected. Yes. You, then you have to wait. Yeah, it's waiting. Yeah, you put it in it. Yeah, you put it in it. Yeah, sometimes I try to put it in it doesn't. Not yeah, it depends whether the um, definition is still managed to run it. Okay, and then? That is a better price now. Okay, so. But I know brokers have a, like a limit. Like they, basically, what they're saying is this you want to go buy a car for $200,000. Right? Yeah. Okay, so if you want to go buy a car for $200,000, you want to go buy a car for $200,000. Right? Now, you told the broker, you know what? You forgot to tell him that when you reach $200,000, you want to be a car. You bought okay. okay? All right. But that day when you went in, it's increased to 210,000 pounds now. And you won't have, you know, um, can you, we still put my note, let's say it increased to 202,000 pounds, okay? And now you tell him, can I put a pending order and can you give me a call tomorrow, right? Once it comes down to 200,000 pounds. He says, you know what? If you walk out of this place right now, there'll be like 200 people coming in. Okay? Your pending order is too near to what you're asking for and what the current price is. I, I, can't, I can't put it for you that quick. So you, why don't you just be here and just monitor the price, just enter line. Okay. That's why there is a leeway of the 12.5 mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Okay. I think we've covered um, the point. So, so we looked at... Um, Buy stock, we look at stock and limit orders, we look at spreads. So there's enough content to go back and think about it. So why don't we just um, carry on with what we started from last week? Do you want to fill it? Maybe you should come to the other one. Very good. Just bring up a new book. Why don't you bring up the chart? Um, so bring up the chart on the left wall, and then just go through like trades where 2013 we did, huh? 2013 we did, and look at trades and Thank you. 
Das ist ein Problem, das ist ein Problem, das ist ein Problem. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah, everyone. Is it one way? Is it one way? Is it all? Oh, come on. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. I've got an art in the middle. Not only you. I'm just going to ask. You would more than ask, like, if you were reading German, like, every letter separately. Yeah. 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 Have you seen what's going on? Don't do it. It's all the way. We thank you in English. Oh, that's right. Yeah. 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 Thank you. So, you can call you Sibon. What fun? What are we going to call you with your name for you now? How much was she going to get? It's not easy because it's felt. Oh, it's not going to get attention. <laughs> I should call you, oi, you know, you're not like, oi, you. I know it should be hard, isn't it? Oh, you. <laughs> and it's all right, they'll know exactly what I do. Just like the dimensionality. <laughs> okay, so you can read the room. I know the girl's name, so it's only you there. Yeah, it's fine. Different folder, right? So it's. Oh, no, 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 no. 
This is called a research journal. The other one's called my current training journal. Yeah, but it's a different folder. You know that. Okay. Okay. The issue I'm having is that everything's got very similar names. There's no boxes for me to post the what my what name. Very very different. So you see, this folder is one of the weekly training. So just say yes. What she does. Okay. But I'm trying. <laughs> the answer is That's a complicated yeah. question, but then the answer is yes. <laughs> yes. And anyway. Could you give a translate oh. for the rest of the evening? <laughs> and for information, your, the, the name of your journal is from the listener. I know it's so. Well, it's not complicated. Where would I be to go? No, 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 <laughs> okay, good. So, um, you can't. You have to do it to learn another side of the thing. That's your choice. <laughs> <laughs> okay. so how did you so get into that from the first bit? Because that's not what mine looks like. Mine's got little words all over it. It's got little words all over it. Okay, so whenever I put it straight, yeah. I should put it coming crazy to it. That's the right, current yes. training journal, yeah. so that's how it's changed. The more of the changes are at least. That's right. Is it one of the things that you find that happens in the last year? Alright. Yeah, it was just in the, just coming in the, you are in the other corner. Oh, yeah. There was a little terrible. Okay. So let me just finish it. Okay, so that's what it loads when I do that. That lot. Oh, just look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Do you just need to download that one? Okay, it doesn't just find the page. So just oh, yes. Go to the template. Oh, yeah. So we have the same thing. You got it, then? Yeah. You got it, then? Just keep on the template, then. I will click on the one arrow, then you will download it. Yes, yeah, okay. so then. Okay. Right. Yeah. Yeah. But remember, this is a web version that you're having. You are what? You're having a web version, right? Okay. Because it's loading on the web. You need to download it into your computer. You need to download Dropbox into your computer. Okay. I've got Dropbox in my computer. So that's it. So open it up from your computer, then you should be fine. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.
right? So we all go all the way to 2013 because it's not yet Tesla. We go to 2013, we go all the way to January. So we go, we start from setting on January. But now you see how to conduct the research is you must not see every other thing that's happened, right? so you must cover everything. Okay. Okay. You must pick as if today is the right? second dog. Because that's what happens in reality. You know, everybody can see the picture and they can kill it. So, let's cover everything else from 2nd of January. Keep moving back first. 4th of January, 2nd of Ghana. So we cover everything. Okay, so that's it. We start from here. Did everyone get that? Yeah? Okay, yeah. Good. You've somehow cut the rest of your chart off, but it, no, it just moved to the screen. Why does it matter if you see friends? All you're going to have to do is kind of like have a stick, isn't it? No, not this stick. This is definitely the same, isn't it? Maybe because of the same, but it's really hard. I'm on the second one, but you see, if you look at the exact date, you use the cross hand, then you can put it on the bar, and you can see it on the bar. Oh, one. <laughs> it's actually real, yeah. right? You do it unbiased. Don't be such a unbiased. Okay. Huh? Okay. So the cross is now. Are you on your phone? Yes. Does anybody know the difference between the image and the other? It's on that bar, right? Yeah. If I change the bar, then the thing will change. But this line here doesn't do anything. Yeah, are you there? Yes, I am. I found your so where are you going now? You put the second on See, you can power this way in most cases. You can always open it up again. Okay, anyway, so we are there. Then after that, we go one part of one bar, right? Yeah? Okay, please. Okay, so find a lift off center. On the lift off, are we going long or short here? So we're looking for long or short? Long, right? So we need first the setup bar, we need to close below. So now we got to close below already, no? Right? Then we need a... Yeah, which is a close. Okay. So we keep going one bar below. So is it close above here? It's a Sunday bar, yeah? Okay, it's a Sunday bar. So now we have Don't worry, carry on with these girls because I'm really looking. Okay, just keep listening. So now the next one. 
as it goes to the bottom now. So this is the thing where we enter the train now. So um, let's take a look and then plot the pressure now. So this is what it is. This is the length of the train. So the opening, the setup was on the Oh yeah, set up communication. We only can we only can have that communication. Okay. Because that's when we enter, right? Okay. This is a question. Why don't you just go back to the journal that you guys have been keeping things right for that? Yeah, but you want to learn about it, right? Did you know what to do with it? Never buy your son. Okay, so now let's just go look. We don't know the date when we enter because um, we don't know when it will get triggered, but we can find the entry order. The entry order will be for the I of the bar, right? One, three, two, seven, and you know? Right? Do you put the number in there? Do you put the cross in there? You can read off the box. Yeah? Okay. Can you read it here? Oh, okay. So, yeah, yeah. So, yes. Yeah. So, this one is. So we go back to the journal and we say it's a long order, right? You're buying, huh? You must enter this, right? If you don't enter this, the formulas won't work. Time frame is very entry reason, this is what? 15 year may have gone up. How many bars in between their bones before it closed the bar? How many bars were there in between? There was one, there was two, there was three, there was four, four bars in between. Between the setup and the left. Isn't this red dot for the right dot? Do the right dot. This time there's four bars in between. That's just the single one. Oh, so it's not really right. It's like a hundred times. This, later on, when you compile the result, you can see if there's any correlation here. Four bars in between. Now, what else? Now, it's an oversized bar as well, right? Just drag that as well. So there's many reasons for this. Okay, so actual fail. Remember what I told you all about buy orders, you can add spread. So the price all you're seeing is sell prices one three two seven nine. So for any buy orders you need to add the tips. So one three two eight one. No one three two eight two right. One three. Look at your uh, manual order. Everything. Okay. Yeah, that's right. You need to attribute some value, but it's only a trace based in there. The low, look at the low, 13038, huh? You need to put one tick below that. So 13037. Look at the low, there's no points. 13037. Then everything is scheduled to be Oh, I see. So all you need to do is only. Uh, see, all the ones you do, all the formulas, in, so don't do anything. They'll you the formulas. Then you need to find the exit points. That's all. So let's see which day we enter because it's pending on the right. But you have to say for the first one. Mm -hmm. so you, you enter on the five plus five bits. That's true. Just the man on this. When we talk, it's the five. So it's five plus the bits, and then the stuff belongs to the five. Okay, so we got that. So now there's a pending order, there's a stop loss order. So let's see the next day we get triggered or not. Yes, we get triggered, right? Mm -hmm. So you see the next day, so the next day, everything went. So we need to enter that day, because that's the day when we enter the trade. The 11th door, what is it? So we go back to the journal and we write the film it is. So that's it. So then after that, we see where the exit price is. So now, how do we check the exit? 
to ignore the wicket during the stop loss and the moving average. Remember, it's either the stop loss gets set or we hit the target. Target is at 13774. So it's not here, yeah, target. Yeah. So we keep going. That's how they buy. So we keep going up, right? So we keep going. On the left, couldn't they? So it means we're still in the tree. We left all the way. Left, left, going right, left. Yeah, couldn't they? Pending order is a problem, right? But the day when you got it. We're still in the daily thing. The report is daily, right? So you keep turning down the blue line now. Okay. So the price doesn't come below it, so we're not up there. Okay. So we keep going up, so we keep going up. Okay. Yeah, let's go on up a little bit more. Let's keep the target. That's 3574, no? What's the target point? 3772. So we're still not there yet, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay? In fact, you know, I caught the guys. Remember, okay, I'll teach you one more thing over here. See, this one here, 245, right? Fits risk, huh? Mm -hmm. Can you see 200 for your face? Yes. Now, to get 2%, we need to have 490 bits. Get how Points. 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 Now, if the pitch risk is only 150, I only need to travel 300 to get 2%. The critical thing here is, doesn't matter how many pips of this here is, but you're still risking mm -hmm. But depending on how many number of pips here, mm -hmm. you either can get 2% faster or it's going to work more to get it. Let me explain. So if this was 50 pips of this, all it needs to do is travel 100 pips, you get 2%. Mm -hmm. But if it's 2.5, it's going to travel 490 pips. Usually, this keeps a red like this. That's right. That usually we like to keep it at one. Mm. Yeah? And we usually compare the ATR as well. You can see ATR 10, this is what we did the last time. We can add the indicator, I'll show you how to add the indicator. Here, I'll take it like this. If you want to insert the ATR, you can insert it. Okay, so that's the simple average rule. And if you want to find it from here, then you just make sure it's there. It's a good number of the average rule. Now, when you put it on that bar, you can see the average rule range for that day. It's about 95 per So, that's what I'm saying. So maximum the number of bits of risk we want is 1.5. Let's say it's 100. So we don't want to put it that far away. So what we usually do in the trip is we would find something which is nearby. Now something which is nearby could in that bar. So you should think we can use the thing. We can pick it. Usually we can put it about 61.8 and below that moving average. Mm. So, yeah. One, three, one, six. So we put it above one pick. One, three, one, six. So one, three, one, six. So I'm going to add a bit. It's one, three, one, six. Mm. That's okay. Okay. Okay, so that's great. So, so now our target would have changed. Would have changed to 3640. So let's see if we hit the target. You had on the day, on the day, you check on your average to an ATR on the day. 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 Okay, so I think we need to talk about it.
Okay, and I think that's all for me. Okay, last part. Uh, maybe we should say one last thing. Anything at all? Are we related to what you talked today? No, well, nothing. Anything else? What's going to happen with anything that's actively being traded at the moment in yeah. August? If everything shuts down in August, does the whole thing just run? Don't know. Don't know. There's things that happen that are currently going on that haven't taken off the full journal. Oh, so yeah, I, yeah, so yeah, I yeah. still check in every day through August. No, no, August won't trade at all. But the current ones, we don't go them, check them. But I'm going to let you hide it from the bottom of 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 the Oh, yeah. That's the first weekend is not good. And when are you coming back again? Yeah. Definitely. Yes, we do. We need to be. And also, we don't want to come next week. Oh, you, you'll be happy to do that, gentlemen. Um, yeah. 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 So when is are we coming? September first. Okay. Take a break for all your hard work. Okay. You don't want to break, right? I mean, you want. We don't want to go all day. We will keep working yeah. on it. I'm telling you that. Yeah, should I tell you the one thing that really irritates the life out of people? And it used to irritate me even more when I was a teacher, the closing down of everything in August. Really? Because the one time of the year that teachers have time to do anything was August, and they used to close everything. Close the whole school, right? Well, you close the school anyway, but things like my church, groups, everything was just shut for oh, August. Oh, wow. Because you drive me absolutely insane, it still drives me insane now, even though I'm not teaching. But you're meant to go on holidays during that time, right? No, no you, go, you go on holidays at any time except August, because it's the most successful time to go. Yeah, you don't go, 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 you don't go,
because in this because the they it's going to school then so they oblige, they have to go to no roof. But then it doesn't make sure you change the door now to say take children out of school when it's not a holiday you don't have room to go. Whereas before you could take your kids out of school, you know, but you can never see. But well, you can be out for the time you are in the house of the country to the rooms. So you can't right. organize something for them. You can't say, okay, I'll hire a tutor. No. No, the statistics show that if you take your child out of school, even for a week, their actual levels of learning and achievement drop quite significantly. It's quite phenomenal. In any case, the office. No, it's interesting. Can you guys bring up and have something else? It's wonderful. No, it's not that. I'm going to say that it's fascinating. I'm coming to visit. Yeah, Joe, we can tell you that you want something black on the top. So, how far do you want to fill this looking thing in for? Oh, just for one year. So, can I have got something? If I want to trade, then my own business, I want to do commodities. Can I do that? Yeah. I want to be able to make a higher surplus. I want to sit and be able to buy them. Because we can't go to something so much further away. Okay, alright. Okay, okay, what I can do now? I can buy, I can maybe buy what I'm sitting. And then shut it and then come out with this two days. I need to do something. Yeah. What's the strategy? That's the only way you can make this. Okay. Just do a one at a time. Okay. And see, I feel like I don't know if it's just fine. It's fine. It's just it's just that I'm, I'm just frustrated. I want to make money. Well, why? Why can't you place this subject with somebody as well? Okay. I don't know if you can buy It's just that uh, if I, um, I need to decide the work because I'm going to make more money so that maybe I can go out and do my money. Okay. Thank you. 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 Any other when you did this thing from here, yeah, I get it that you leave it still on another little boxy thing. Maybe or maybe not here. In this boxy thing could fit in. Oh yeah, you you don't have to get that? No, but that no, but just now it appeared, but now it won't do it. What do you want? Well you were pulling off lots of data based yeah. on what you could see on the screen. So you could either click on the thing from data from the bottom of the top, or you could look at the top. No, at the bottom of it, I can't say, yeah, yeah, go to the right. Yes, of course, we have it in the screen. This one. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 So, call on the bottom, and you get all your data, that's it. Oh, okay. And you also had a whole load of numbers that appear up here, on little dotted white lines. What was that about? Just a process. No, it wasn't a process. No, you had something extra that no, you had no, lots and lots of numbers on it. No, no, it's not quite the one you want. Well, this is the Fibonacci level, right? Yeah. Fibonacci, you mean, huh? When you want it, yeah. I don't remember what it was, that's what I was asking. It's Fibonacci. It's when you were moving in. I'll tell you what, um, Mr. What I mean, do I need it for? Do you still have a few basics that you're not sure of? I have a lot of basics I'm not sure of. I'll tell you what, some people are kindly offered to, like, help push people in. Okay. Like, for one, basics or whatever. It's also the best thing you will need for the time that you take that. Okay. You can have to sit down and play and all this. What's happening with all this stuff? This is the team house, so she was like, very busy. So she was busy using an animal. Oh, she got tax a bit because wanted to do some training. Context of best thing. Not you. Context of best thing. Well, she's busy. She was going to train me, but I have to do it for some best thing. Yeah, because it's better, right? One point of time, you know? So let me say, it's doing it all the time. So she's going out. So she's going to be stressed. So she was like, please give me some papers. Okay. Hmm. okay. I thought she was with a, a conference for the under 35. Oh, yeah, she was doing it. I don't know. 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 I